It's been said that a mile of highway will take you one mile, but a mile of runway will take you anywhere. Proceeding one zero eight one five. Where will your passion for aviation take you? Today's aviation industry offers a wide range of amazing career opportunities. We are going to introduce you to three different people who all have the same passion for aviation, but have achieved very different career paths in the same industry of aviation. If you have a deep passion for aviation and becoming a pilot really isn't your thing, the aviation and aerospace industry is full of different exciting careers that don't require a set of wings. My name is Jeremy Gunn and I'm an airport operations specialist here at Centennial Airport. Jeremy's passion for flight not only guided him into a career in aviation, his passion led him nearly 9,000 miles to Colorado, all the way from Australia. I'd finished my pilot training uh, back in Tasmania, Australia, and I got my commercial license, and I was doing some further training, and I sort of had lost the fun in the flight. Jeremy's passion soon took him on a different journey, where he pursued an internship at Centennial Airport. Here, he learned the first-hand skills of how to operate a busy general aviation airport. And I came across Centennial Airport, and I went for a flight out of here just to get the experience of flying in America. And I was looking at their website, and that's where I saw their, their internship program. And I got back to Australia, and a few weeks later, I just bought a plane ticket and came right back. And the timing worked out, and I got, the, got, the, got into the program, and here I am. Your pretty much job is to keep the airport running day to day, keep everything running smoothly and safely. We coordinate the emergency response in the event of inbound aircraft emergencies or accidents, uh, any instance which involve um, outside aid. So you're the one that's the, the first one being called and you've got to coordinate. You're the central point of communication. There are the radios, our airport frequency, and this where I can contact uh, Arapa County Sheriff's, South Metro Fire and Rescue, um, other staff members, and also the tower call me on here if there's an aircraft uh, incident. And the good thing is you see so many different aspects of the airport and how it's run and what it takes to keep a you know busy airport as, as busy as this one running smoothly. That's something which definitely makes the job interesting is you get to, especially someone that likes aviation, which if you're doing this job you definitely would, you get to see the smallest of the aircraft that people train in, do aerobatics in, up to C-130 military giant four propeller aircraft. Um, we have F-18s, we have Gulf Streams. With the internship, being given that high level of responsibility and trust from the beginning, it allowed me to grow a lot faster and uh, you know learn all these new skills a lot quicker. So when I noticed Centennial Airport and it was a busy, um, diverse airport, I thought that could be really interesting to learn and go down that track. I didn't know exactly I was going to like it. I didn't know if it was going to be the perfect thing for me, but I gave it a go and you know got my interest and I'm sticking with it and seeing where it takes me.